Hey Capricorn, this is Nikki. I hope that everybody is doing well this morning. I came to bring you guys your general read for Monday. Um, yeah, it's some energy that's on this board here um, that we need to discuss, y'all. Um, I'm going to give you an edification card after um, all of this too, okay? Um, I've already, you know, I've already went over this energy. And uh, yeah, this energy is not... <clears throat> It's not that good, y'all, okay? I don't like this because this is y'all first read from me in 2023, okay? Um, listen, before I start, let me thank my new subscribers, you guys. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for your support, your love for the channel. Um, this channel loves you and is always giving back, y'all. Um, if you have not subscribed, uh, please take this invitation to subscribe. Um, uh, there's so many incentives going on right now. I just announced my December winner. Much love. To Jada, um, gave, she just got her free read um, not too long ago, a few hours ago here. Um, and uh, yeah, so the next runner up is coming up. I mean, we in January, I will be announcing January's winner of uh, February 1st, and I'm giving away a whole bunch of stuff. Go check the description box, you guys. Um, there you will find what the giveaways are. There's several things in the description box, okay? But I think like number three is where the giveaway section is and you'll be able to see the stuff that's being given away okay tarot cards oracle cards free readings all that okay and for what for every 100 new subscribers there will be somebody else selected to get a, a free read as well okay and whoever gives me the most views during the week on this particular video um will get an extra general read on the following friday okay so with that being said, um, if you guys uh, want any information about me, that's going to be in the about box. And this is a general read for the sun sign of Capricorn. You can check your ascendant, your descendant, your Venus, and your Mars, and all also might resignate, okay? Listen, Capricorn, I'm, I, I, you know, hey, I, I don't know what the fuck this shit is about, okay? But all I can tell you is, is your overall energy is the Ten of Swords, okay? Somebody here is in very deep anguish, all right? Somebody here is... Um, you know, betrayed, you know, hurting, in pain, all right? Got everything to do with somebody else, okay? Who I see on the board is Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Who I see on the board is Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus. Possibly Sagittarius, okay? And that's without us even clarifying, all right? You got the hangman out here, okay? This is stagnation, you know. This is, you know, ain't nothing shaking. Hold on one second. Let me look at the bottom of this day. Let's see what went on here. Let, let's let's get this underlying energy real quick. All right. I see somebody fighting. Somebody done pulled up. Somebody fighting. Somebody in a fighting mode. Attacked. Bullied. Beat up. Somebody withstanding some type of adversity. Somebody got King of Swords in their energy. Somebody got a whole lot of temptations and carrying on, okay? Different options, all right? Somebody got to the truth for some type of matter. Got something to do. I love you too, baby. Got something to do with a third-party situation, all right? Yeah, we got negative consequences here. Somebody was a giver. Death came to this. Death came quick, okay? Death came quick. Show y'all this underlying energy. Okay. You got fighting. You got beefing. Okay. You got somebody is attacked. Somebody something. Somebody withstanding some type of adversity. Some Something went down. Okay. You say King of Swords energy. Somebody is cutting somebody. Ruthlessly cut somebody out. Somebody is being ruthless towards somebody. Somebody got somebody, a whole bunch of options. You know, this is right here is temptations like a motherfucker. Okay. All right. Somebody got a, somebody got clarity of this situation. Clarity of what? Clarity of that third party, that, that broken heart, okay? You see them swords in that heart, okay? Yeah, this right here, this is judgment in reverse, okay? There's negative consequences behind this here behavior, okay? Somebody giving, okay? Maybe they got negative uh, consequences behind the giving, okay? Giving what, though? Because death damn sure came out, unless it's a transition that looked like something came to an ending fast, Okay? With that there eight of wands. That's what it looked like to me. Okay. So that's what you that's 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 the reason why somebody in this ten of swords. All right. This deep anguish, this deep pain. All right. You got hangmen here. Ain't nothing shaking. Don't somebody don't know what the hell going on. Somebody don't know what to do. Okay. They're waiting. All right. 
there's a sacrifice that needs to be made. But whatever sacrifice takes place, there will be a reward. And sometimes the sacrifice is to leave things as they are, okay? To go through the motions, and maybe you will be rewarded in that. Sometimes the hangman means going to jail. With this here ten of swords, I mean, that could be abuse. That could be domestic abuse. Somebody might have whooped somebody's ass here. Somebody might have gotten into a fight, okay? With this hangman situation, maybe somebody doesn't know what's going to happen in court, okay? Because we got the eight of cups right next to that. That is going off. That is leaving, okay? Yeah, but we can look at it like this too, okay? Because of this hangman situation and does, somebody does not know what direction that somebody is going to be going on, somebody is just standing in limbo because somebody walked off from the situation, abandoned the situation, somebody is losing courage regarding this here 10 of pentacles, okay? So somebody abandoned somebody here. Somebody is losing courage regarding this here family. Ten of Pentacles is family, okay? Now, let's take it back to the beginning, okay? We got stagnation with this hangman mode, okay? Right up underneath, we got King of Cups. This is Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, okay? Something ain't shaking with this person, okay? Energy over to that, we got the Eight of Cups. Somebody left, somebody walked out, somebody abandoned ship, somebody thought that the grass was greener on the other side, somebody went off to go do some shit. Now, do we know if they're coming back? We don't know. But one thing I can tell you is that Page of Swords is right below that, okay? So what that's telling me is, is, is that somebody is going off gathering a whole lot of damn information. Somebody here is a liar. Somebody here is gossiping. Somebody here is telling somebody's business as they done went off, okay? Business about what? Business about this family, okay? Finding out information about this here family, okay? Yeah, gossiping about this here family, all right? Yeah, somebody younger than somebody here. Okay, but the end, the, you got the first one out is the Ten of Swords. End result is Three of Pentacles. That's building a foundation, okay? So throughout all this energy, okay, it looks like to me, okay, when we start clarifying here, that you're going to go from one mode to a whole nother mode, okay? Deep heartbreak, anguish, betrayed, left the dead, whatever the hell happened, okay? But at the end result, we got Three of Coins, okay? That's building a foundation. That's teamwork. That's collaboration, Okay, that's moving up, okay, with the right people on your team, okay? So let's go ahead and clarify this. Capricorn, I hope that you guys are doing good. Hope that you guys have a wonderful new year. And I hope that you have enjoyed that uh, that new year's, um, that little energy I pulled, you know. I was tired, y'all, you know what I'm saying? Shoot, I know y'all could look at me and tell I was tired. My lashes and stuff was coming off and... Y'all, you know I'm comfortable with y'all. I don't give a fuck about my lashes coming off like that. Yeah. As long as I give y'all the message. Yeah. But hell, y'all. I brought it to y'all, though. And didn't even fix it. Y'all knew my lashes was falling off. Let me tell you something. I didn't even think twice about going up and go fix the damn lashes, okay? I said, shit. I said, my signs need me, shit. Fuck that. Y'all know what it is, shit. Y'all might come on this bitch one day and see me with a bonnet on. For real, for real, okay? All right, so listen. Okay, let's go ahead and clarify this ten of, this this ten of swords. Holy Spirit, cause somebody love. We got a mother figure here. Okay, this could day this could be a dude. Okay, so we got somebody that's emotional. Okay, we got somebody that's loyal. We do got somebody that's psychic here that got gifts. Okay, we got somebody that's compassionate. We got somebody that's sensitive. They overly sensitive. They even may be a tad bit petty. Small shit get to them. I feel them because I'm a petty motherfucker. My damn so I, I, I trip off. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I trip off small shit. I do. I ain't going to lie to you. Yeah, I, me and my man was talking about that shit. It could be the smallest of the motherfucking small, boo. Yeah. If I feel like it. Yeah. But that's how this person is, too. So I feel them shit. I ain't talking about them shit. I'm the same damn way. What is she doing, Holy Spirit? And hang me, i she don't know what's going on. He, she don't know what's going on, okay? Just waiting, okay? That's what they're doing. They're waiting for more information, for waiting for improvement, for waiting for somebody to surrender, sitting here in limbo, okay? They're in uncertainty, stagnant. They're waiting for some enlightenment, okay? So you got two hangmans here. That's double confirmation, okay? That's why the Ten of Swords is happening. Okay, and that waiting is killing somebody, not knowing what's going to go on, not knowing what's going to happen. Clarifying this hangman and this uh, 
waiting for something to grow. Okay? That's what they're doing. They're waiting for something to grow. Something that they have nurtured. All right? They're waiting to see improvement. They may be getting a bit impatient. Hold on, let me feel this energy. They may be getting a bit impatient. They may feel set back. But they're still waiting. They're waiting for a harvest. They're waiting for growth. They're trying to be patient. But their patience is running out. This person that's in pain. Okay? They don't know what, what direction this relationship is going in. Give me the King of Cups. Holy Spirit. For your sons and your daughters. Somebody could be spiritual here. This could be marriage. This could be traditions. Okay. So the person that's in pain, that's in, in, in this stagnant mode, that's waiting. They're waiting in limbo to see if something is going to grow. What they want is they want the love. They want what they look at as their counterpart. And what they're waiting on is for this person to tra transition transition into the mold to where they want to get right. They want marriage with this person. They want tradition with this person. Okay? But this person is always high and drunk. Give me more. This person moves too fast. This person is too hasty. This person needs immediate gratification. Good or bad. Give me more. This person is possessive. This person holds their emotions to their chest. So you really don't know what the fuck they feel for real. This person could have money issues. This person is secretive. But this person also be out, okay? They lead the scene, all right? They get missing in action, okay? Why? How? What? When? Because they out there planting uh, seeds, okay? Seeds of what? Give me more. So they lead you to go plant seeds. They might travel. They might like to travel. They want some type of achievement. But they plant seeds and karma coming for them. This is a Capricorn. This is a Taurus. This is a Virgo. What is it? What are they doing? Could be a pregnancy here. Magician is here. Let me see, because magician can be good or bad, y'all. We're about to see. Manipulating, tricking, <clears throat> altering energy, okay? We got a witch here. We got somebody doing spell work here, okay? We got somebody very sexy, somebody very strong, somebody courageous, somebody that is confident, somebody that has a temper and can be funny, but definitely is a hoe, okay? What is she doing? This is where this person goes to and does. Mm -hmm. But it's backfiring, okay? Remember I told you got a witch here? Okay, well, let me tell you something. It's backfiring, okay? So now what this person thought that they was doing when they go off and plant these seeds with somebody else that's doing all this fuck shit, guess what's happening? They're being haunted, okay? They're being haunted. And I'm not talking about regular haunted. I'm talking about entities, okay? Yeah, and they feel with fear. They're filled with anxiety, negative thoughts, okay? They may even be hallucinating, okay? Breaking point, despair, 
depressed, mental health issues, okay? They need some help. They're trying to cope. Yeah, they're being haunted. Give me more. And it's all because of this, this fuck shit they got going on. Yeah, see? They need to change. They do. They need to change. They need to leave the past alone. It's what they need to do. That's what they're thinking about while they're stressing and being haunted, okay, by entities. Yeah. They know they need to deal with this, this situation, okay? They know they need to deal with the situation with this two of cups situation. This marriage. This sacred union. This love. This soulmate. They know they need to deal with that. Something needs to change. They know they need to do better. Work with them. Work with them. Collab with them. This person is strict and cold. And confused as fuck. They haunted. Somebody haunted here, y'all. Yeah. Somebody haunted. Okay. It is just that simple. Okay. So let's see what it was going on with this page of swords. What was all this nosiness about? Somebody knows something. Somebody wants to know something here. Somebody got a sacred knowledge. Somebody spiritually gifted. The high priestess is here, y'all. Very high intuition. Psychic gifts. They know. Somebody knows something. So, you know, with Page of Swords being nosy and shit, you know, trying to gather information and gossip and stuff, well, you, you got somebody here that already knows. Somebody is getting information on this here family situation. Somebody knows that somebody is getting information on this family situation. And they're burdened. They got stress. Because there is, there's gossip going on about this family situation. They're frustrated about this. Somebody complaining. And somebody feels, god dang, somebody feels self-doubt. Insecure. Low self-esteem, self-imprison, they also are being haunted behind his lovers. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Behind his lovers, this divine union, this strong bond. And the person is, is on the way. My fiance got a song. It's called On The Way, y'all, okay? And that's what's happening, all right? It's almost like they won't leave them alone. Give me you more. Yeah, they own the way for some conflict, y'all. They own the fucking way. This motherfucker, be on lookout, okay? Be on the motherfucking lookout, Capricorn, okay? Because this motherfucker is on the way. This lover situation, okay? This motherfucker that's being haunted, gathering information, on this here family, okay? They own the way. Yeah. This motherfucker that's being haunted. That's dealing with this. This queen of this who dealing with this 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 queen of wands is doing magic, doing spell work. Yeah, it's backfiring on their ass though. But you need to understand, they own the way. And what they on the way to do is conflict, confusion, beefing, fighting, bullying, being jumped, attacking, set up, messy shit. Could be gang related, could be shootout, okay? Five of Wands is up there. It's in the unit. Anything goes with Five of Wands, okay? Friends and family, side piece, uh, mad, you know what I'm saying? All that shit, okay? All them scenarios. Hold on. Somebody lost courage when it come down to this family. Okay? Give, give me this seven ones in reverse. 
Yeah, because of the lies, the alibis, the, street, the strategic, sneaky ass, tricky fucking moves that they making, okay? Because this enemy, this hidden enemy or obvious enemy, this deceit, this thief, somebody done jacked somebody. Yeah, this faking is phony. That's why they losing determination. They losing courage when it come down because this is the motherfucker they dealing with. Like I said, they pulling up. They on the way. Okay. Period. Give me, give me, give me more Holy Spirit, please, for your sons, your daughters, and for your glory. Cap, you got some shit going on here. Somebody's feeling hopeless. They keep in the faith. They're optimistic. They want healing regarding the situation. Okay. I want to know more about the Seven of Swords. Somebody had somebody knows, okay? Somebody got ultimate clarity that somebody is is a liar, a cheater, a thief. Give me more. Somebody has ultimate clarity here. Capricorn, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus us back on the board. We got nine of pentacles, okay? We got somebody single here, okay? So to whereas. You know what I'm saying? Maybe they wanted a family here with this ten of coins. Well, we got nine of coins now. That's missing a coin, boo. Okay, we done took a step back. What happened is this person is not here anymore, okay? But the abundance is still there, okay? The money is still there. Somebody may be dealing with a Leo. Somebody may be dealing with an Aries or a Sagittarius. More. This is another individual on this board, y'all. What is he doing? Or somebody may be cutting out an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. But listen, we got a lot of people on this board now, okay? We got the Queen of Swords. We got the King of Wands. We got the Queen King of Cups. And we got the Queen of Pentacles. Okay? We got some messy shit going on here. And we got a lot of players. Okay? So I don't know what fits what, Cap. Okay? All as I know is, is these is the players. And, uh, yeah. So let me see something here. Let's find out. Shit. Hold on. Where that Queen of Pentacles at? Okay, we got the Queen of Queen of Swords. Yeah, there's some people up in y'all energy. There's too many motherfuckers in y'all energy. Here we go. Oh, they forgot about this wedge. Hold on. All right. All right, so I'm about to tell y'all what these people is doing. First, let me uh, let me see the ten of coins. What happened? Because the family is fucked up, okay? I'm just saying. All right, somebody is a giver here that was in this family, okay? Somebody did more giving than, than somebody received. Something happened real quick, okay? Slowed down, walked away, chaos, delays. No, get, no give and take. Somebody flirting all the goddamn on time. Somebody coming back saying sorry. Somebody younger here. Easily damn distracted. About this ten of pentacles. You got that twice. So you damn sure got kids. You got a family going on here. Because of this third party. Okay. All this celebrating. All this goddamn out, outside the house. Okay. Bullshit. For real. Okay. Alright. So let's see. Let, let's see. Let's, let's see these people. Okay. 
Yeah, they like to party. They like to gather, all right? They like to do shit that they want to do, okay? All right, so we got King of Cups here. We got Queen of Pentacles here. We got Queen of Wands here up to no motherfucking good. We got King of Wands here, okay? So they may be working together up to no motherfucking good, okay? So we about to see though, okay? See all these people. You got one, two, three, four, five motherfuckers in y'all energy. Hold on, wait a minute. I think you do got one more. Yeah, you do. You got King, Queen, of, King and Queen of Swords here too. So this could mean Queen and Queen of Swords in your energy to just block this shit completely, okay? They just might, they may be here in y'all energy to have gotten to the truth of this here matter, okay? And say, fuck that, okay? Period. We're cutting it off. It's just that simple, all right? You got the king and queen of wands here in y'all energy, all right? But see, this queen of wands here, I don't truly believe got anything to do with this king of wands, okay? I think this is in another scenario, all right? Because this king of wands, this queen of wands here, she's up to no good, okay? This king of wands, we about to find out. But let me start with the king of cups. Tell me about the king of cups, Holy Spirit. This is a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, okay? For Cap Capricorn. What is they doing? Traditions. Wound to love. Or divorce. You got a Virgo here. They're thinking. They're thinking about this union, okay? Tell me about this um Queen of Pentacles. This is a, a this is a Capricorn, a Virgo, or a Taurus. Either catching karma or walking in a different direction. The will of fortune is here, okay? Something is changing in this person's life. They're getting to the point towards they don't want something, okay? What is this Queen of Wands? Holy Spirit. Because this, this right here, she doing some shit. She changing shit around, okay? She doing spell work. And what is she changing, Holy Spirit? What is she trying to attempt to change? She wants somebody to have some burdens. Give me more. She wants somebody to have a whole lot of stress, a whole lot of frustration. She want to affect somebody's money. What else is she doing? She wants that... Uh, she wants this person's counterpart. She wants king of coins, okay? She wants this Capricorn Virgo Taurus is what she wants. Yeah, she's doing fucking spell work to do it, okay? Be on lookout for this Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, okay? Tell me about this king of wands, Holy Spirit. Fighting. Friction, beef. Give me more. Player energy, whole, whole mode. A player energy. A Leo on the board. Got choices and overthinking them. <clears throat> reckless out just out here just out here like that not even thinking give me more where is somewhere around might be a pregnancy somewhere somebody sees a bright opportunity for something tell me about queen of swords holy spirit cutting out that uh page of cups Cutting out that baby, baby, please bullshit. Yeah, cutting out that god dang on somebody planning and plotting. Okay, getting to the truth of that matter is what she's doing. What is King of, King of uh, Swords doing? Holy Spirit. <whistles> moving forward. Moving forward with the, the information that Queen of Swords has picked up. Okay. Don't like this information because it is sudden change, the sudden chaos, the sudden ending, the sudden information, okay? King of Swords is upset. 
give me more. Right, and now I gotta make a, a set priorities. Okay, give me more. It's a lot of bullshit that went on. This is the reason why somebody got everything to do with this motherfucker that's charming, sweet, selling somebody some damn dreams. Okay. Might be a new beginning in love or might be you're trying to reconcile. This is the Ace of Cups. Okay, it goes the way. But no, because you got another person here now. Got third parties all over the motherfucking place. Okay? All over the goddamn old place. Okay, y'all. This is what I got for you because I can't even take no more of this shit. Shit. Capricorn. Shit. The hell? All right. Let's, let's get an edification card for you. Let's see what Holy Spirit would like for you to know about this situation because there is a Capricorn right now that is in deep anguish. Okay? Because that is the overall energy and it is because of all this fuck shit. Okay? And I just broke it down to y'all. Y'all might have to go ahead and start the video from the beginning and just start looking at it from there. You know, whatever y'all miss, because I know I was going fast. When I be up in that energy, y'all, a lot of times I be channeling, okay? So, you know, I don't necessarily, you know what I'm saying? I'm not really paying attention to, like, my words, okay? Because then it's too much, okay? When I'm getting too much information, I'm trying to talk, and it's coming out, okay? So you might have to go back. But you need to go back if you didn't get some of this shit because you got witches involved in this shit. You got spell work involved in this shit. You got third parties all over the motherfucking place. Okay, you got motherfuckers begging, baby, baby, please, trying to come back, but still want to go out here and do things that they wants to do. Yeah, it's a lot going on here, okay? So, um, Holy Spirit, for your sons and your daughters, I need an edification card. What would you like them to know for their highest good? In this situation. Potion. Remember to practice self-love. Remember I told you somebody's self-esteem is being affected? Remember I told you somebody was full of self-doubt? Well, Holy Spirit wants you to know. Practice self-love. Okay? You see how this chick off to herself? You see what I'm saying? She in her room. She got a whole lot of stuff. She's surrounded by her stuff, okay? This person is transmuting energy, okay? That's what she's doing. Transmuting energy. Practicing self-love transmutes energy, okay? And that is what Holy Spirit wants you to know. You do got the, the power to transmute energy. And when I say transmute energy, I'm talking about taking a ten of swords and turning it in to something more happier, okay? Once you practice self-love, you will know, you will begin, okay, to learn how to do that. And you got to surround yourself with comfortable things, familiar places, and safe places. This is a safe place. This is her bedroom, okay? The number 24 might mean something to somebody. Or the number six may mean something to somebody. Okay? So, yeah, practice self-love. Go ahead and transmute this Ten of Swords energy. Okay? Because it's not just you and it's not just the person. You got somebody also manipulate energy in which they need to watch out. Okay? Because depending upon who you are, Capricorn, if you are a chosen one and if you are uh, protected by the Most High God, uh, boo-boo, they got some stuff that's fixing to be backfiring on them, okay? And that's some real shit, and I already see that, okay? So, uh, first of all, it's not going to work, but just understand, you got arrows, okay? Somebody is shooting arrows, okay? And, um, you know, they're conjured, all right? And um, But you need to understand, that same motherfucker that's shooting them arrows is the same motherfucker that's being uh, goddamn on haunted, Okay? Or whoever got any part in it, okay, is being haunted, all right? So, uh, with that being said, you know what I'm saying? You get what you fucking deserve, shit. As far as I'm concerned, shit. Uh, me personally, that's how I feel. I mean, you go fucking with stuff you don't know nothing about, then shit, you reap them type of consequences. It's just that simple. It is what it is. All as I know is, is people need to know who the fuck they dealing with before they start conjuring and shit is what I'm saying, okay? Because when that shit go to backfire and boom, that shit is not nothing nice, okay? It's up there. 
everything is on the table, okay? You cannot call yourself entering the spiritual realm illegally, okay? You cannot do that. Shit goes to coming back on you, and especially when you fucking with the high priestess, okay? A person who has God giving gifts, okay? That's a fair warning for y'all, okay? That is y'all fair warning that I am issuing out, okay? Because, baby, when you mess with a chosen one, when you do things, okay? Even the slightest of the things, okay? I'm just going to tell you because it's my job to tell you, okay? That is up there and everything, boo, is on the table, okay? When you're dealing with spirituality, okay? Yeah, when it's time to get yours, when I say everything is on the table, you need to go read the Bible, okay? And really find out what kind of God we serve, for real, okay? And it'll let you know that, uh, yeah, women, children, men, animals, landscapes, all that shit. It's up there, boo. It really is, okay? So, before you start taking that route... Start thinking about who and what you love, okay? So, that's what I got for uh, you Capricorn. And that's my little warning message for uh, those who uh, feel deep in their heart, okay? That they know what the fuck they doing when they be fucking with spirituality, okay? Yeah, it should get ugly. It get real ugly, okay? So with that being said, you guys, um, I love you guys. And um, you guys, um, stay safe. Transmute that energy. You got the power to do that. And especially if you a child of God, boo. If you a child of God, you got that power, okay? Rather you know it or rather you don't, okay? So with that being said, Cap, I, if you guys give me the most views on this video, you guys will get another one on Friday. And um, like, share, and subscribe. Make sure you comment down below because... The giveaways are starting all over again, and I will be announcing a wonderful, beautiful winner um, in January. And uh, until I see you guys again, much love, much light, and much looking out. Bye, Cap.